uh, in between recordings, um, my Altus Cargo moved from here to here and killed Weevil's, uh, was it a Quaker Hercules? Yeah, yeah. And so Weevil lost, like, 600 points, and now all these guys, 50, bro. 50. Look at this shit. Uh, also, her today's video is paralyzed, that sucks, uh, but I can summon, summon machine. So what shall I summon? I shall summon, Ring of the Aqua. Always a good summon machine. Play that in the mode, and let's see what we will do. Will he commit suicide? Yeah, he wants the man. Very well. Make your choice. But will this end? A marvelous house. Now prepare yourself. I shall never. The Furious Sea King. Tons of tights. Heck yeah, man. Promotion. Alright. And let's kind of loud. See what I can win here. I guess another review dismissal would be bad. Uh, also, Petite Moth wouldn't be bad. Because we need cards with like lower costs for the other deck. For the Vita. Oh, cool, we got into the dismissal, that's good. Uh, let's try it for three in a row. Uh, oh, missed it by one. Oh, well. So I guess at this point, I should try for... Well, I guess it doesn't really matter. I guess Bear Trap wouldn't hurt. Uh, that's one that's due to green pain. Oh, missed it, darn it! So I only got two cards out of that. That sucks. That sucks. But I was way too late on that bear trap. It wasn't quite three. It was more like two and a half. Two and a half. But, uh, yeah. Sorry about that, guys. But, uh, yeah, we're recording with the laptop feed now. And, uh, I guess I'll do one more duel. That way we can end it at four team. And, uh, yeah. My favorite number. But, uh, Alright, let's swap out some cards. I'm gonna show you a card, I'm saying. So let's go to the second deck, and we're trying to get rid of the high stuff, so I guess we'll get rid of Rose. Yeah, that gives us a little wiggle room. 
And now if we put... Hmm, are there even any insects in this deck? Well, I guess there's one. Uh, uh, there's a couple. Alright, so we'll put in this. Wait, where are the two big insects in here? Yeah, that's kind of dumb. Uh, let's take out both of those. And let's put in a this missile. Ah, yeah, now the deck house has got significantly down. I think we can add back the rows of the dot. Probably. Also, Crocodile is really high deck cost and really serves no function whatsoever. So, let's take that out and let's put in uh, Rose, shall we? Because I really didn't want to take her out. Also, I have two of these in there. Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. So I'll put one of that, uh, one of Rose, of the Dun, 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 Dun. We have three, nice. Ooh, 853, I think that's like perfect on the deck cost. Um, now, now I've got another infinite missile that I'm wanting, so I definitely want to include that uh, in an alternate deck. Uh, let's go all the way up. Yeah, there we go. So, 21, 20, 21. Uh, I think two CK men is a little. Don't really need two, so let's get rid of one and put an infinite dismissal. And so now this deck, how's this deck looking on spells and traps? Uh, this first deck. Uh, pretty good, honestly. We got, we got some spells. We got the original spells. I have Truth, Chorus, Kaishun, Mermaid. Uh, we've added two infinite dismissal and the fake traps, which is good. Also added the two negative attack. That's pretty good, honestly. So a total of our spells and traps is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. That's getting a little better. Um, now in this, yeah, 853. Let me, uh, let me back out here and let me check the, uh, thing for Weevil. Is it 854 or... It is. Hey, that's perfect. Okay. So now we can go with the B deck. Uh, the B blue eyes white dragon deck. So uh, let's go. Right? Alright, and we're still recording? We're still live? Okay, let's do it. Alright, first you with the blue eyes white dragon deck. The blue eyes white dragon deck. Alright, it's just a butt. And not a blue player head, per se. So, uh, now the, uh, the Furious CT uh, recently leveled up. So now what we can do is that, uh, now he's one lieutenant, no abilities. But, what we could do now is actually make the Furious Sea King a deck leader. And we are now eligible to do a Weevil with uh, the Furious Sea King. Now, the benefits of this would be that we can add, uh, like a main of the Aqua to the deck. Because we could basically take one out, put her in the deck. Uh, so that's, that's good. That's very good. So we got another card that's eligible to be a leader. That's very good. Uh, let's just summon, um, let's summon, uh, let's not summon anything. I have a plan. I have a plan. Trust me, guys. Trust me. Alright. Ready? So, we're gonna play. Giant Reach. Yeah, yeah. Arm of off. Yeah. <laughs> Tons of tight. Dude, that is such an easy. That's a big chunk of it. Go, sir! Suffer time, you captain. You tap one with the territory. 
get four larger. I don't know what we were thinking there. That's right. How? How? Nice job, Kyle. And I am Isaac. Alright. What's up, Yeah, 18 minutes. It's escaping. I don't think so. Ah, I move forward. And now we're going to play another card. I play. What shall I play? I think Hercules beat up on here. Good summon here. So it's summon you. Attack! Oh ho 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 ho! Oh ho 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 ho! Nice. So we tied. This ought to be interesting. Let's watch. something more random. <laughs> uh, gotta love the internet. Uh, we still recording? Is this live? Is this live? I think we're good. Okay. What time are we at? 13 minutes. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now... How about this? Ha! Go! Tons up tight! Maniacal laugh. Oh, oh, maniacal. All right, people. Well played. Well played. But now we play times one. Go on. Time you shit ten. Time search. Counter strike. How? Feel the power of the flood. Mm -hmm. 
Fusion's hardly ever made by the table, but uh, yeah. Uh, just so you know its weaknesses, uh, he'll try to make this fusion, but hardly ever will. So number one, this card can't move. That's its biggest weakness. While it's still uh, Larva of Maw, can't move. Uh, nature effect, uh, so if it's a face-up defense, survives five turns, transforms into uh, Hoopa of Maw, which is... Basically, one turn away from being either a great mob or a perfectly ultimate. So, but yeah, pretty nice card to have overall. Uh, can receive some power ups. Uh, I would recommend the first two. Also, I would actually recommend Crush Card. Not a bad power up to give it. Uh, yeah, so uh, yeah, that's uh, Larva of Moth. And we just made it for the first time. That's right. Defense mode, yeah. Now, what shall we do? Uh, ah, Scorpion of the Twinkle. Well, I think we'll just try to attack the red thing. Yep. Black work. Alrighty, and I think after that, I'm just gonna move away. I am not turning you. Oh, attacking? I don't think so. Oh man, you just committed suicide, sir. I think you just committed suicide. But hey. It's very rare that the team long attacks, so let's watch the attack. Swing shot! No! <laughs> I think I just won. Yeah, that was kind of a bad decision. Kind of bad. Not gonna lie. Uh, zero out of ten would not be great. Alright. Well, let's try to get that Remedy card, shall we? I mean, that would be, that'd be great, honestly. I don't know if I can get it, but I'll try. It's got, oh yeah, it's got that broad leaf, I see. Uh, dang, I was too fast. I'm a little too anxious. I gotta, gotta calm down. That's one. Bam! Yes! Awesome! So we got the Goblin Secret Remedy. That's very good. Alright, what other card do we want? Um, I guess Hercules Beetle? Because we already have four of the Rose Spectre, Army 3, so... Yeah, where's the Beetle? Uh, oh, I see. Beetle... Oh, the Beetle's right by the Leaf, though. Maybe I will go for Rose again. Let's see, Rose... There you are. As one, bam. As one, bam. Oh, okay, so we got Rose. Cool. I'm cool with that because we can always reincarnate the uh, Rose Spectre of Death. It's right around 40, which is a pretty good deck cost to reincarnate. What time are we at? Uh, 20 minutes. Okay, guys, well, with that, we have um, concluded part three of this recording session. And we are up to 40 wins. So I think we'll just edit the deck a little, just, just tinker with it a little. And uh, yeah, after that, we will end this episode. Um, got another fake trap. Honestly, now, fake trap, you may think, sucks, but. Um, and it's very specific, only works with 
Harpy's Feather Duster, but I like Big Trap because it's only five deck costs now. See, this is the B deck, the, the deck that have the really high deck costs. So, uh, for example, Big Trap, what we can do is go to deck cost, take out something really high, you know, that we honestly won't use, like uh, Mr. Izume. Pretty high. Now, uh, but uh, two up in your own, I think two's good. Uh, is that what Of course, that's good. Uh, Trepanos, I like Trepanos. Uh, Yato Karu. Yeah, you're kind of just a placeholder, big boy. You gotta go, sorry. Play some fake Trepanos on there again. Yeah. And uh, Kwakata Beetle. I, I can see why I put this in here, mainly because I'm fighting people a lot, so I can see why I put that in there. I, I can see why. Uh, flying Penguin? Yeah, yeah, okay, sure. Um, I'll probably take out... Um, yeah, Giant Scorpion of the Tundra, 21. Yeah, it's just kind of basic, you know? I'll probably take that out, yeah, and put in, like, this Goblin Secret Remedy. Because it's a remedy, that's the experience. Now, I could put that in the the A deck, my uh, Ace deck, but I have a feeling, like, of the two decks, which will I need to restore life points in the most? Probably going to be this one, not going to lie. But now we have two Cocoon of Evolution? Okay. Uh, do I have another Maw? So I have this one. Do I have a second Maw? Okay, I guess I have Beetleworm, so I have two Maws. But I'd like a third Maw, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, let's look at the deck cost. Let's see, did I win a Maw and just kind of forget? Uh, no, that is something that I should take note of. Um, oh, no, no, I did. I won Beetleworm. So yeah, let's take out Zari again. Doesn't really fuse with anything. Now let's put in Needleworm because it does fuse with the two cocoons that we have. So that's this this B deck is honestly looking pretty good, not gonna lie. Honestly looking pretty good. Um let's see, what else? What else shall I change in the B deck? Uh, I kind of want to put in the third... Um, no, I kind of want to put in this. Quagar. Quagar's really good. And I have two power-ups for it here. Three, actually. Um, so I really want to put in Quagar. Uh, 36 that cost them. Uh, well, we'll have to take out something pretty... Uh, I guess we could take out Zari Gun, right? Uh, let's see. Just doing a little math here. Basically, we're gonna add 23 deck cards. Does that work? Hang on. So I put in Quagar. Yeah, 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 that works. Yeah, okay. I, I thought it did. I was just like, eh, math wise, that should work, you know. And I kind of want the third rows in. But, you know, if we can't do it, we can't do it. Uh, Akihiron, just way too good. Um, Hercules Beetle. I like the defense, I really do. Plus the power of work on it, so don't want to get rid of that. Uh Kyrie should be way too good. Yeah, um sorry Rose, I just I can't fit all three. I, I wish I could, but uh Yeah. Okay, so that'll do it I guess. And I guess we'll end things uh there. And uh yeah, so this will be a nice uh, little um uh, twenty five minute episode for my laptop and uh yeah. Well, guys, uh, thanks for joining me. Um, you know what? Should I just should I just do one more, and that way we can reincarnate to start next episode? Um, you know that's not a bad idea. Um, usually when I play this game, I do it in uh, you know, uh, games of five. Anyway, so. I'll tell you what, let me just take a quick uh, bathroom break, guys, and, you know, just kind of chill and listen to the music, and, yeah, we'll go for five, uh, and I'll be right back, so enjoy. <laughs> Thank you.
still alive? Okay, I think we're good. Alrighty, guys, we are back. And I just thought of something. I guess it could scoot you guys a little closer. <laughs> I still have my, uh, my, uh, setup from the cell phone. But there's no need for that. I can easily scoot you guys. Oh, yeah, that's better. <laughs> that's what Danny likes. Uh, yeah, so scoot you closer. Kind of tilt the camera. There we go. Okay, sorry about that. <laughs> Some of you are probably wondering, like, uh, yeah, some of you are probably wondering, like, man, why is the view zoomed out? What the? All right, yeah, sorry about that. Wow. Now, is that Alpha or Omega? I'm not sure. Steal his soul. Now, your quiet is done. Let's I am Okay, so here's the thing, guys. We want 
this part of the dial. can't win it, so... Yeah, we, we want this card. We really do. So, we want this card. Go, Hurricanes! powerful card. I don't think you can win the slots. Because, uh, yeah, I drew, I drew 
move up as an extra with two power ups. And uh, the last time was good. Not gonna lie, like, he might KO me with Rose. Most of my own doing. I should. Let's see what I can pull here. Uh, one space to go. Bear trap. Wow. Bear trap. Dude, is this gonna work? Oh man. Well, let me put it this way. I hope to God this works. Um, bear trap, protect me! Alright, and my turn, we Let's see what you've got. Let's have your triathlon weapon. Bear trap, protect me! Yes! Activate now! It spare his monster and destroy it! <laughs> yes. That's a beautiful stroke of justice. Alrighty! Now, I choose my final track by Maki Hero to fool my new monster. Hunter Spider, you. Dang, man. Only beat me by 100 points. Alright. Hunter Spider. Not a bad card, my friend. It is poison, right? Toxic. I really wanted the chance to get this man in her bug, so could have won easily, but you know, I want this man in her bug, so let's try to get it, shall we? Missed it. Oh man. Calm down, Josh. Duel is over. Duel is won. Got it, got it, got the man in your bug. Uh, shall we try for the leap? That's asking a bit much, but, yeah, why not? That's one, man. Mystic. 
But we got the Hunter Spider, and I think that's a good deck cost. So it's round 30. A lot of field cards round 30. So, all right. Well, let's take a look at the bounty, shall we? So, yes, I will override it. definitely that data. And let's take a look. So, we got Man Eater Bugs, 16 deck cost, just way too good. And that's the crazy thing about this game, guys. This is only 16 deck cost. Automatically kills one of your, like, biggest problems on the field. I mean, that's, that's MLG right there. 16 deck cost. Gotta have it, man. Gotta have it. So we go to deck cost. And let's compare something we have with 16 life. Majerus life. Completely trash, bro. I mean, blade fly. I mean, this this card doesn't really even help us, but uh, I'll look at uh, it. Hitogen check. Mm, not really fighting machines right now either. Uh, so I'll probably get rid of Hitogen check. Uh, flying Penguin. Honestly, bro. Honestly, bro. Honestly. I might get rid of this Flying Penguin. Just because it's, <laughs> it's kind of flying, peeing me off. But, uh, yeah, tell you what. Let's get rid of Flying Penguin for Man Eater Bug. That sounds good, honestly. So there we go. And, um, I could get rid of my Lock Attack for the third rows. Um, mm, but I think I'm really lacking all the spells and traps in this deck, so let's see. One, yeah, only one big trap? Yeah, I'm lacking. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, actually, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Actually, that's not bad on this film trap lineup. Uh, but do I have anything else that's around 25? I don't think so. Yeah, I gotta keep Mori. I guess I don't have to keep Terminos in this deck. Uh, I hate to see you go, buddy, but... Uh, no, I'll get rid of block attack. I, I mean, I don't, I don't need block attack. I don't need block attack, so we'll get rid of uh, block attack. So. Now, I could put block attack in this deck. That would not be a waste, honestly. Uh, so yeah, let's put block attack. Go card color sort. Uh, yeah, let's put block attack in this deck. And that way we have a fake trapezoid that's free for this deck. And what shall I get rid of for a fake trapezoid? Uh, uh, something I don't really need in this deck. Um, boy, Slim Pickens, Hitoden check? You're on the short list, my friend. I mean, you might... I mean, 18, that's asking a lot for the deck cost. I mean, no, these cards are basically throwaway. Melting Red Shadow... Uh, you know, uh, I like Griggle. I really do. It's good for fusion and stuff. Um, yeah, uh, man, the toe didn't check. Really, really not carrying your weight, pal, so you, you gotta go. I'm sorry. And, uh, yeah, I will gladly take that big trap. Yeah. Alright, and so next episode, we're going to start by doing a reincarnation. Um, yeah. And, uh, also, um, I know that last recording session I did was really, 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 really long. So I'm going to double check that, like, two hour recording session and make sure I didn't, like, say anything I wanted to go over with you guys. Um, maybe some, uh, hints and, well, there's actually some tricks I kind of wanted to go over with you guys as far as reincarnation and it's perfect that I left the reincarnation there because that way I can go over with it with you in the next episode so yeah thanks for watching guys we are at what's name oh 45 minutes okay cool but uh yeah I will see you all next time bye bye <laughs> have a uh, happy Labor Day weekend Bye, guys. Oh, man. Post-crits. Oh, thank goodness.
Credits, what would? Nah, I like I like post credits. Post credits are really fun, man. And yeah, just was eating a little snack there. <laughs> I'm sure you guys heard me. Yeah. Don't have to announce them. <sighs> what should I vlog about post credits, man? Well, first of all, <laughs> I, I'll tell you what I'm about to do in post credits right now. This whole memory card situation. So, yeah, that's getting resolved right now on recording. Because I know if I do it on recording, it's done. It's, it's a wrap. So, turn to the title screen. Man, I, I don't know what I was thinking with this. But, uh, yeah, so I got these two blanks. And that one in there has the file. So, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to reset the... Uh, I guess I'll just go ahead and show you guys what I'm doing. So, uh, yeah. so sorry if you're you get nauseous really easy or anything like that. Basically, you're gonna reset right here on the PlayStation. And uh, yep, there we go. And now this is a slim, so it starts really quick. So it just kind of pop the hood right away. There's our dual set of roses. Now we do not want to overwrite this save file. This one with all the markings actually has a. Uh, Diego's um, uh, Duelist of the Roses save file on there. He's just kind of working on it on him, by himself, which that's pretty cool. So I'm going to take that one out. And. Okay. So I'm going to put this one in, I think. And yeah, we'll just basically gonna copy the data over, you know. And I, I know if I have you guys here with me, that hey, it's, it's done. It's a wrap, you know. So there we go. And we go to, uh, oh, on the TV screen, obviously, we go to, hey, I guess this is a copy tutorial now. <laughs> we go to Bowser, I mean browser. <clears throat> Hashtag not sponsored by Mario. Uh, so, so we go to the first memory card, right? Yeah, because this has, yeah, yeah, it just changes it. Okay, so we go here. There we go. Do some the roses. Alright, and we go here. Yeah, 11.01. Yeah, yeah, that is today's date. Okay, so, man, that's crazy. This thing even, well, it's not that hard to keep date and time, I suppose. Uh, is that the right time? That is the wrong time. I need to, has it been daylight savings time? I think it has. Um, but let's check this second memory card, actually. Ah, yes, okay, so we picked the right memory card. Now, one thing we don't want to do is copy from two to one. I have made that mistake before, guys, and oh, man, does that suck. But, uh, no, this says the primary file. And as you, if you're ever confused, like, check the dates. Like, see this? Yeah, yeah, 808. So that was the last recording session, basically. Um, or that was the last backup file section was uh, August 8th, 2019. And look at that little Karibo. That, that, that little Karibo is so cute, man. I love that. What, what, what a nice little Karibo, man. See, if we all had a little more of that little Karibo in our lives, we might laugh and uh, have uh, cases of uh, L-U-L-Z, a.k.a. lols. Uh, but <laughs> that's the 29th. And... Um, yeah, we're going to copy this over, so copy, and destination, yep, yeah, two, and, uh, yeah, uh, are you sure, you know, you know, when it asks you that, always check the date and time and stuff, uh, but that should be correct, uh, yes, I will overwrite that data, baby, overwrite previous data, yes, thank you. Thank you, System Functions. Take care now. Bye-bye, then. And, of course, like I, I have 
man, I had told that story about my sister removing the memory card. So, oh, man, like you saw how long it took to copy. So, man, very, very nefarious, very easy to do, man. So, all right. And so now for the final check, of course, did it really copy it, right? Yeah, yeah. So in order to check that, all you want to do is basically, I mean, hood still pops. You want to remove the card with the, uh, the, you want to remove the memory card with the original file. Boop, should be fine. You know, it's in this part of the system properties. Not going to mess up anything. Remove the copy, move the copy over, and we're going to close the hood. And, of course, we're just going to check to see uh, this got 15 wins. Um, yeah, and that, that's basically it. Um, so, yep, that is pretty much it. So I will sit you guys back in front of the TV. And we should be right back So, uh, yeah. I guess enjoy the intro because I'm going to do something on my phone. And basically, I'm going to get the first episode I worked on tonight. Get it started uploading. So let's see. Let's go to see the, the handy dandy YouTube app. YouTube app. Okay. Let's play Yuki The Duelist of the Road. noticed it in all the times making this intro but the player who's attacking okay so the blue eyes ultimate dragon space up right you can clearly see its stats the player who's attacking with black luster soldier is basically an idiot I've never really noticed that yeah they're an idiot wow ah uh, post credits only in post credits would I what I think of that commentary, yeah. Who, <laughs> dude? Who is attacking with Blackluster Soldier right there? I don't know. I don't know. Whoever you are, you're an idiot. <laughs> just, 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 guys. I know we haven't gotten to that part of the game yet. Trust me on that. Trust me. Trust me. <laughs> you do not want to go there. Woo! All right, and 15 minutes, no losses. Uh, let's check the deck. Get on the deck. Always make sure to check the deck. Uh, 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 uh. And we still got a reincarnation. Nice. All right. Well, guys, uh, uh, yeah, uh, that's it for post credits and. Uh, uh, yeah, um, I don't really know what else to say. Uh, yeah. Um, well, actually, in the post credits, you know, you know, since I'm here, since I'm here. Okay, so post credits, um, one thing that I am going to, um, sort of uh, suggest about post credits. Let me put in Diego's memory card really quick just to just to illustrate my point. So basically you guys just saw me everything that was on the original memory card, right, is now copied onto the new memory card. Which is great. It, it really is. Um 
So that makes a total of three memory card files, right? And as you saw, or maybe you didn't see, um, I have four memory cards. Uh, there's a reason for that. But now we're here on the trade screen, and um, for this reason, guys, here's what I would recommend. Um, now, um, you probably, well, number one, if you have a friend to play along this game along with you, that's fantastic. Uh, have your friend play alongside of you. But, um, what I would recommend is that both you and your friend, uh, invest in a backup memory card file. And one of the, like, I didn't really ever explain this, but I'm going to explain it now. So, one, um, one, I, I guess the nicest way to say this is one cheat. One cheat you can do with this game, right, is you can, uh, basically do what I call the file cheat. Now, uh, let me go ahead and turn on the light for this explanation. But the way the file cheat works is basically... Okay, so let me explain the situation. So you've got Diego save file here on the right. You got the file I just copied on the left. Uh, basically the way the trade cheat, and this is why I disallowed trades for this let's play because it's just too broken. Uh, basically the way this cheat works is you get as many copies of whatever card you want that you already have. How does that work? Well, you have three memory cards, right? And basically this has the file that, you know, has the let's play on it. And this has the first slot has the exact same file. So basically I can send all the cards from this file over to Diego's, or let's just say Diego isn't playing, and I just wanted like nine Maiden of the Aquas, so all I would do is just uh, send all copies of cards from this file, the first one, just send it to the second one, and then I would go to the where I was before, you know, in the uh, PlayStation kind of, uh, you know, where you pop the hood and copy files. Basically, the file that now has like six or five made of the Aquas or whatever, you just copy that new file onto your first memory card, right? And then all of a sudden, you're basically duplicating your results. And I never really explained that cheat, but that's a pretty, um... Well, I'm not going to say it's an obvious cheat, because as a kid, I never thought of that cheat. But, um, yeah, that cheat, well, I'm going to call it the file sharing cheat. Because this file sharing cheat, guys, the reason I've disallowed it for this Let's Play, um, and I don't know why I'm going on this tangent, but it's kind of important. Uh, it's all post credits. I'm sure most of you have clicked that on the video by now. But, uh, the reason I've disallowed that cheat it's because it's way too easy. Basically, with that cheat, the same, it's the same thing, file sharing. You can get as many reincarnations as you want. I'll explain that in the next episode. You can get as many cards as you want, and you can just basically just... You can basically, you know... Basically, like, take what I said, right? Copy in one file onto another. And, then, and and here we have three memory cards, so I can even, I can even, like, basically build it up to where I have nine of everything I have, put it all on Diego's file, and then just kind of start over if I wanted to. Um, which is kind of crazy, but, um, uh, the point I'm trying to make here is allowing you know, allowing myself to trade between memory cards opens up way too many cheats, um, which is why I haven't done that. Um, uh, I think one thing I did leave on episode one, there in the description, is that I am allowed one trade, 
Um, like, and by that, I mean, like, just one card. One card off of a trade, that's it. Not allowed to take, like, the entire album that you see here and just kind of send the whole, the whole kit and caboodle. I'm not allowed to send that over. Um, so, uh, yeah. I don't know really what my point was, but I guess I just... Since I had just copied that file, I thought, hey, I could go over the copy file cheat. And uh, now, if any of you have questions about how to perform this cheat, I can I can literally take a video and explain it slowly. But I think most of you get it. Basically, you want to these two right here on the left side. They're the same file. And basically, what you want to do is send like all the cards from this file. Send it to like I don't know. Let's let's say a file you've had since you were like twelve. Send them all to that all the cards you've gotten to that file, and then you know this file is the same as you know one like I said. And so you haven't really lost anything on your LP because on your Let's Play because all you want to do then is this card right here. It now it doesn't have any cards. Well, you can do two things at that point. Delete this file, start over, which which is always fun. Or you can basically back up your Let's Play file again, you know, and send the same files and cards and magic cards and stuff. Or you could copy your master file, you know, that you've had since you were, you know, 10 or whatever. And basically you'll have copies of everything at that point. And then you'll send, like, I don't know, the... Let's say you only had two blue eyes white dragons as a kid. Well, now you have four. And then, you know, you just keep you just keep copying and trading, keep copying and trading, and before you know it, you'll have nine or ten or whatever the maximum amount is on this game, I'm not really sure. But uh yeah, that this has officially been now I'm not actually gonna do it, because that would be a really long process. But if you guys want me to do it and like take twenty minutes and just BS basically, I can and I will. Um, so yeah, leave a comment question. Would you like me to show how to do the memory card cheat? Because it's actually really easy to show. So uh, I wouldn't mind doing that. Uh, comment question number two is um, uh, I had a comment question, but I forgot it. Um, oh. It's a very simple comment question. Uh, what deck did you start with on this game? Uh, number, I should be asking number one, have you played this game before? Number two, you know, what do you think of the LP Let's Play in general? Do you like it? Are you kind of just here for the commentary? Hey, hey that's cool. Um, and the final question is, if you did play this game as a kid, you know, what was your... Uh, what was your favorite deck master? Um, because there's quite a lot that are available as the, uh, s like the starting deck master. Or, if you want, you could put a deck master that, oh, hey, you know, kind of like Furious Seeking. Like, he's in your deck, but he wasn't your original deck master, but he just kind of grew, or she just kind of grew to be your favorite deck leader, as uh, she did over time, so... Yeah, yeah, just leave a comment. Uh, that's just a really random question. Uh, yeah, what's your favorite deck master? Um, but yeah, with that, I'm going to let the trade screen in us out until 105. And yeah, this has been the trade cheat tutorial. <laughs> and uh, part three of the uh, upload. So, bye guys. <laughs> For real, I mean it this time. Post credits over. Get <laughs> yeah. I Game over. Game over. Flip, flip, flip on. Oh, Cause y'all don't hear me. Dude, no one remembers that song. No one remembers that song. That song, that song was lit, bro, back in the day. Game over. Flip, flip, flip. Oh man, post credits is so fun.
Well, guys, um, hope you have a good night. I'm gonna basically go do what I said don't do. I'm basically gonna go cheat and help Diego with this game. So, uh, yeah, bye. <laughs> uh,